they like got a call back. Like they yeah, were, they got called back. We see. Yeah, like we they, did it though. <laughs> like we didn't get a call back. No, at all. we're so not talented. Like we're. <laughs> All right, guys, so as y'all can tell by the title, we're going to do a childhood memories in Hawaii. Yeah, we're going to do like a reacting to childhood photos, but we're probably just going to do that sometime else because, first of all, we got to find them. I have a shirt on, by the way. So we're just going to get into this because my mom's trying to rush us. All right, because she want to go to a luau. We're going to start this um, childhood memory stories by from the time where my sweet sister, girl, that was you, <laughs> pooped on a purple No, carpet. she... <laughs> well, literally for years she's been lying telling people that was me and it's literally her who pooped on a purple carpet. I think it was a pink I carpet. don't remember. Okay, so yes. Yeah, anyways, next. <laughs> she pooped on a purple carpet. It's alright. <laughs> she also... Oh, it's just a little... And we used to share rooms when we were younger. No, like all four of us were in a room. Yeah, like, no, like it was like weird because like every year we would be in a different sleeping arrangement. Like me and Alexis had our own rooms for like... A two cool, seconds. Oh, I was about to say like a cool two years. Oh yeah, we did have our rooms. Yeah, we had our own rooms, and then my mom. We had a bunch of like roommates or whatever, like just people my mom knew, like our uncle and stuff. And then um, we had this really big, like I don't even know what it was. Like it was just this really big room. It was a living room, and they turned it into a room. No, but it was really big. Like yeah. she was long. Like she. Yeah. We actually it was like half, half of the house. Yeah. And then like my mom built a wall in between it, and half of it was like a playroom or whatever, and then the other half it was just like. A room and then my mom put bunk beds and all four of us were literally in the same room so speaking mm -hmm. of bunk beds one time I had the top bunk bed and she slept on my bed one day I, I never sleep on her bed so that's why it was like weird and like, she woke up on the freaking floor yes. <laughs> like, I, remember I woke up and I was like What's going she on? literally woke up on the floor but let me tell you before that like a while before or after I'm no really I think remember. it was that no it wasn't her yeah. We're eating hot Cheetos. It was hot fries. We're eating hot fries. Well, yeah. not. I don't remember hot fries. No, it was hot fries, and I remember I didn't like hot fries after that. Like now, I like hot fries. And she freaking it. threw up on my bed, like literally <laughs> all over my bed. And it was like my first time on her bed. And like I slept on it. I don't know if I like rolled off and like not didn't feel it like, because I'm a heck of deep sleeper. Like <laughs> she fell. On her it was so high. Yeah, it was like pretty high for How being did you know? <gasps> Oh my god. I need one time okay so at our old house the same house that's where mm -hmm. used to like okay let me just tell you i walked in the bathroom one day it was like two it was like really late at night like 1 a.m 2 a.m because i had to go pee you know them um the shards that are clear that you can see through mm -hmm. that you can't really see through but it's blurry yeah. i seen like a tan thing on the floor i was just about to talk <laughs> about that <laughs> i seen a tan thing on the floor and i was like don't tell me, but don't tell me there's a dead body in my house. Like, don't tell me. She, no, we we had two bathrooms, right? But me and Alexis, like, never used the main bathroom. We always use our mom's bathroom to do everything. Like, go to the bathroom, shower, everything. So, I remember, I remember wait, that. Wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me. Girl, I was going to tell myself. Wait, wait. So, I remember I was on the toilet. Um, oh. And I opened it all slow, and Deirdre was like... On the floor, bro, and she's naked on the floor, like no, I like, remember curled like up in a ball. I remember like that exact day. I remember I was so tired, like I took a shower and I was like, let me just take a nap. <laughs> and I remember I slept. Like, no, girl, I was like ten. <laughs> no, in the I, shower. I remember bro. I was in the shower and I was like, my mom will find me. I think <laughs> like it's no big deal. And uh, I remember like I got the loofah and I was just like. <laughs> I was just snapping on the loop. I was like, ooh. And dude, look, that's so funny because no one asked about you or nothing for like all the hours you were gone. So, I've been the favorite child. Like, don't. No, don't even because that's why nobody was asking for you. Dude, I remember when I would get mad or like mom would yell at me or I'd get in trouble. I would go, I would actually like I ran away and go outside. And like, you know how our backyard is like a big? Yes. I would go hide in the, um, wait, wait. The grass. Oh. You would hide in the grass. Or I would hide like um somewhere. Like where the shed was, I would just stay there for like twenty minutes. <laughs> oh yeah, we had like really long grass. Like our grass is literally like white. Like nobody took care of it. White? Yes. We had no green grass, honey. Well, it was brown. <laughs> why would grass be white? Because it's like so dead. That's why. Gra that's brown. It turns brown. Yes. Okay. Oh yeah, also in that house, um, when we were younger. And we would clean, like I never wanted Oh my god, I have a story. Go, go, go. 
Oh my god. Wait, okay, so I remember we were at that. I don't remember if it was at that house though, because I feel like the setup was different. Like from where, from when we moved out, I think the setup was different, because I don't know if it was at that house. But basically, oh, it was at the house. I think. Okay, we were at somebody's house or whatever, and it was like a big group of people. It was like people like we knew since we were like little, little. Like it was all of our cousins. It was some of our friends. I think it was your birthday party. Like, I don't know why I remember this so vividly. Or, oh, I, it was at our house because I remember I, I recognized the hallway. <laughs> but we were with a bunch of people. Like, we were with people that were, like, full. Like, we were with, like, we were with all of our cousins, all of our friends or whatever. And I remember we all were, like, in a little sleepover, like, palette or whatever. And we were just watching movies. And I remember, like, the whole house was dark except for, like, one light, I think. And then everybody, like, looked... Like everybody looked at our hallway and saw something, and everybody was I so scared. That. Like every, like even the oldest teenagers that were like we're seventeen scared. were so scared. Like everybody was shook. Like nobody wanted to call the parents. Like Dude, yeah, I was shaking in my boots. They like, said they seen like a little girl going like this, but none of our little sisters weren't there. I remember I was, I was asleep. And I was like under the blanket hearing them talk about it. I was like, I'm not working anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no, like it was so bloody. Like, that was such a traumatic time. Dude, I think life. that house was haunted. But I think the girls like this. Yeah, I think she's like. <laughs> they're like, they're kind of. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no, but like, we were so scared. Like, it was so I'm, scary. when I'm telling you, like, the sh the fear we had, and it turns out it was the vacuum. Oh yeah, it was the vacuum. <laughs> I don't remember who walked out there. I think it was me and somebody else. And then we walked out there, and Wait, it was it the vacuum. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Y'all better not be cussing. Anyways, um. no, but like everybody was so scared. Like we were all like just staring at it for like an, a cool hour. Like we were like, yeah, because it was. That's dark like the only thing I like can remember from like paranormal. I think. No, let me tell you, bro. Oh my god, are we doing? Are we turning this into a paranormal? Oh god, don't scare me like that. <laughs> no, one time in that same house, remember that roommate who lived with us, mom's friend. Which one? She lived in the pink room. Oh, she, and she, was, she had a she dog. Was like a redhead. Yeah, yeah. it was cable. <laughs> I don't remember that. Bro. Remember she brought a TV and had her own cable and we could finally watch TV? No. <laughs> Dude, we had Netflix when like Netflix wasn't even like an app or anything. It was like this little black box and like you had to get that box to watch Netflix. So I don't remember that. But um we're gonna pop in. Okay, so I remember that that lady lived with us, right? And she had a dog. And I remember joking like, um, I'm gonna lock your door, I'm gonna lock your door. I was a little kid, I don't remember what I was saying something like that. Yeah, I remember when she moved in, she like painted the room. Like we yeah. were only gonna be here for like two months. Like she only ended up staying with us for like two months. Okay, so basically painted the whole room pink. Okay, so basically I was But you know what kinda like <laughs> not back then when I was like a Bethany Can I stand. talk? Okay, like obviously. Okay, so basically channel. I was joking about locking her door, right? And um like later that day her why am I like crying? <laughs> why is she getting emotional? emotional? No, but later that day her dog was in her room as a little chihuahua and she could not open her door. Like it was locked. And I was like I swear, oh my mama. Oh my mama. I swear, like to this day, I know for facts I did not lock that door. Cause how am I gonna lock it if it's from the inside anyway? So yeah, I was like, she had like two brain cells. Like now she has like three, but like, still. And she was like getting mad at me. I was like, I didn't lock it. I was so scared though. <laughs> like, it was really scary. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> okay, so. Oh, wait, back in that room, what we're going to? I don't know. Oh, the one where the cops were, like, knocking on <gasps> Oh, my God. Yeah, I just thought about that. Oh, my God, guys. One time when we had our own rooms. Okay, so my room is in front of the house, like, like right next was to the, the door. Yeah, right? it was the first window that you can see. Actually, no, that was mom's, but. No, mine was the first window. It was right next to the yeah, door. Yeah, it was, like, right next to the right door. Next if someone to was to rob us, it would be uh, her yeah. room. Yeah. I had my whole escape plan ready. <laughs> um. So, one time. It was like three in the morning. I was a little kid, like and 10 she years was old. little, yeah. Yeah, and I just hear like on my door, heck, of my window. Dude, heck and what's hard. crazy is like she always tells the story, and I never heard it. Like I don't remember anything from that. All I know about this is that like what she told me. Like I do not remember waking up. I don't remember none of this happening. There's some crazy experiences in that house. Like one time, there's the drive by. Remember that? Oh my god, I remember that. Right, we'll mom, get to that next. Mom, so there's like literally the loudest knocks I'll ever hear in my life on my window. And yeah. I'm like, like even if I'm mad, I won't even pound that hard. Like, I just woke up and I was like, <laughs> and I look, oh my god, and I just hear police, police, police. I was like, what did we do? <laughs> I'm and like, oh no. And I ran to my mom's room and I was like, there's police. <laughs> and basically, so something about a car that w 
was connected to yeah like, like we used to have it or i think like we have it now like i don't remember it was like a car we had no i think if they used she used to have it she sold it because how would they know oh yeah i don't remember but oh, there was like some murder stuff up in there and the yeah, other like, story um and it was like connected to us because apparently like the other people I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a drive by by that house. No, we lived in like a ghetto, not like ghetto, like it was still nice, but it was like ghetto, it's, like compared ghetto. to like what it was we had the, after that. It was in the hood, hood, but it was pretty, it was ghetto over there. Yeah. It was good times. That was a fun neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but one time there was a drive by, right? And I remember there would always be houses. And there would always be parties in our neighbor's house. And like, we, would, always we would like jump on the trampoline and try to look over, <laughs> and we would be like, ooh. Oh, AT. <laughs> My mom and her friend were in the front, like, because there was a party and they're all trying to be funny and stuff. And literally, a car, they're in the front when this happened. A car comes by and starts shooting, like, literally a yes. drive by. And it's like, pop, pop, pop. And we're in the house, like, really? Like, oh. And my mom, they, they get on the floor. And they're like, and my mom run inside and she makes us like go in the middle of the house and stuff. Yeah, it, it's like behind, it was like in our hallway or whatever. And I was, I remember I was like, my mom was so dramatic. I was like, hey. I was like, hey. I was like, hey. Like, no. Like, no, I'm just saying, but um, that was pretty scary. And uh, I think, I feel like that happened a couple times, but I don't, I just don't think we like remember. I just remember that time vividly. No one got uh, killed or nothing, but we're good. Yeah. Dude, one time I remember, in that neighborhood, not our neighborhood, but the like, house is right across from Abbey Street. Mm -hmm. Dude, they found a dead body in the freaking closet of that house. And I think it was the abandoned uh, house. Dude, oh my God. Remember, Do you remember that house? That scary house we would drive by, no. the dark house right next to our house. Me, you, Lexi, and Alyssa, and we always like like look at it. <laughs> <laughs> There's like a red dot, and we were trying to figure out what it was. Oh like. my gosh, dude! Okay, so we were like heck close, like with these two girls. They were that they lived like across. diagonal from us or whatever. We were close with them for like a good four or five years, but we don't really talk to them now that we moved. But we were hecka close with them, like we did everything with them. So we would like always be like just roaming around the streets, like we would just be doing everything together. And um, I remember we came across this house, it was like hecka dark, like there were like cracked windows and stuff. Like some of the windows would be like half up and half like... It was a busted house. Yeah, it was like hecka. And it had like curtains. And we didn't even know if like, and I feel like... We like, never seen anyone come out the house. Yeah, and we never Damn. seen, but like we always seen car there, cars there, like... There's like one car. Yeah, I don't know. But there was like a red dot. Like, I remember we looked up at a window. It was like one of the highest windows. And there was like a red dot. And then Like, it was recording. And then like the the blinds, like you could see the blinds. It kept like opening. Like, you can tell when it moves, like it's opening. And then it closes. And it's opening and it closes. Like, it's like someone's like pinching up. And then like you could just see and then close it. And I remember it was so scary. I don't remember anything else that happened. I don't remember. I knew we would drive by it and stuff. And like, I'm driving Girl, by it. We were on a bike. Bike, bike, bike. I mean, we, bike. Would, we would wheel by it. We were scared though. But we were some nosy little kids. Yeah. Do you want to be instigate? Wait. Oh, investigators. Yes, so so bad. Bad. Yes. No, but um, I remember in that neighborhood, I was like throwing rocks. And like the neighbor like started yelling at me and told my mom. <laughs> and that's all I remember. Do you remember when we moved to, um. Pilgrim, the one yeah. the two story, and you threw a Cheeto over. She threw a Cheeto <laughs> over, and it was like Jehovah. No, it was a Snickers bar. <laughs> okay, so after like we got out the ghetto, we went to this really nice house because like my mom got money, <laughs> like all of a sudden. And um, I remember when we first got there, it was like this. <laughs> That is so funny. I forgot about that. I remember it was like the second time we went to the house. Like we didn't have any furniture in. So um, I remember we were just like looking over the fence. This is when I was like 13. So I don't know why. <laughs> You're not 13. You're like 12, I was like, 11. Oh yeah, I was like 11. You're little. Okay, but <laughs> we were there and we were just looking over fences like seeing our neighbors and stuff. We saw one of the girls, like one of the people has a pool. It was like right diagonal from us. Like and I don't even remember. Like I don't think I threw it, but I don't know. No, you threw it over and she threw it back. <laughs> Like, I better <laughs> stop I'm telling your mom. Wait, was it a Cheeto or was it a Snickers bar? It was a Cheeto. I mean, okay, a Cheeto. I, so I had a Cheeto and I like threw it over her fence because I wanted to try to get in her pool. <laughs> You're weird. And then she like, she I didn't, threw it back. Yeah, I didn't see her and she threw it back and then she told my mom. My mom pressed me the whole car way home. Dude, before we lived in that little ghetto house, we lived in some little ghetto apartments. <laughs> <laughs> it was like the first house I remember. I think I was like... No, I remember another I think one. I was born in that house. We were there for a minute. We had like a tiny little backyard. Yeah, it was literally like the... It was like half the size of this room. For it was so little. Mm -hmm. And there's this boy over next door and his name was Bobby. I remember his name. Girl, I told you his name because you were like, who's Bobby? And I was like, I knew Bobby. 
You're 19. Okay, so basically that's my first little crush. Uh, we would talk <laughs> over the fence. Yes, stuff. we would literally talk over the fence, having these pointless like small talk <laughs> conversations. And, we're like, and then we moved and never talked again. Yeah, like we didn't even tell him we were moving. I know we did. <laughs> we're Aww. like, bro, that's how we died. <laughs> Why <laughs> is that funny? Bobby, if you see this, we miss you. We miss you. Okay. In those apartments, I remember we used to always go down in like sheets and stuff in bed, um, like blankets. Remember? Mm -hmm. And one time I went down and freaking got a nail like this big in my foot, like in my foot. Oh. Tiny. You don't remember that? No. Yeah, I remember that. And we just took it out. So I don't remember anything from the house because I was like heck of a Yeah, I was a little too. I, whenever, whenever my mom, because we had like really dirty rooms. Like it would be to the point where like you would like trip if you tried to walk into me, you know? Oh, like our, little? yeah, our rooms were hecka dirty. Mom, we had all our toys. Yeah, and, why are you being all serious? Like, yeah, we had all our toys. Yeah, we had all these toys. Yeah, you know, you can't relate, but, so I remember like my mom would make us clean our room and I, like, I for real looked up to Alexis, like, because she's like my older sister and stuff, like, not anymore, like, she looks up to me, period. No. But, <laughs> but like, I would try to impress her, like, she would go to the bathroom for like five minutes and I would like do the most I can to try to like pick up our room. She would like clean the room so fast and what was and she funny? would come in and be like, oh my god, I no, love you. No, she would come in and be like, and like go on my iPod. <laughs> yeah, she'd be like, I would not even care. But you know what's funny? I would stay in that bathroom long because I knew she was freaking trying to clean fast. Girl, excuse me? <laughs> oh my God, who was it? Was it Rachel? Oh my God, it was one of our sisters, the little sisters. We get Rachel and they couldn't talk, I remember this. And they hit their head on the brick like really hard. I think they were bleeding. I don't remember, but it was bad. And like, I was scared. I was like, because they couldn't talk. So like, and how would they get up there to hit their head on the brick? Because it was like high. So I was like, is there aliens? <laughs> no, dude, I used to think you were an alien. <laughs> Girl, I'm what? so serious. I remember when I was younger, this is my location to be on the internet. Now, we're gonna speed this up real quick. I remember I seen this post and it was like, it could be anyone. And it was like two little girls and then like the second post, it was like one of the little girls being an alien. And I remember <laughs> Dedra would get so mad when we would fight like crazy. So oh I my like, god, I, have, I had like random bursts. Like I would literally not be myself. Like I would- She would be like a demon, bro. I thought she was an alien. <laughs> yeah, like, my face ever. would get like purple. Like I actually remember like- You're like, like, really like Rachel now. I would get like heated inside and I would literally like kill you. Oh my god. I'm like- <gasps> Just kidding. I don't know if y'all remember this, um, if y'all too young, or I don't know if you guys never just experienced this, but did anyone else try out for that shake it up dance thing? Oh my. Okay, so, let me tell you a story. Okay, so we had like, we, I was like obsessed with shake it up, like even after that. No, yeah, we were like obsessed with shake it up. I remember like Netflix, um, I remember like Netflix shut down for a little bit. It was only like, I think like, no, I think like we didn't pay our bill or something and it didn't let me watch it. And I remember there were like three full episodes on YouTube and I would just continuously <laughs> watch them Bro, for, like, the whole, for like the whole two weeks that we didn't have Netflix. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no, but on Shake It Up, bro, they had that little dance contest and I remember we would, uh, we were trying it's out. A dance show. For, you obviously No, it was a dance place. contest. It was a dance show, but remember we tried out in my video? No, but like they, oh yeah, we like tried out or whatever, but I feel like it was like one in a million. Like I, yeah, you would not, unless you're a really good dancer. Yeah, I feel like they picked people that were already famous, so it was kind of a scam. Yeah, but I really was like, I really thought I was going to win. And I right. remember we got yeah, cute outfits. Yeah, we all like got outfits. We told all our parents. I remember she was originally in it with her friends, and they like left me out. And I cried <laughs> to my mom. And it was like, and then my mom made me do solo. Because <laughs> my friends are being mean. <laughs> It was like a certain number limit. Like you couldn't have more than five, I think. And there were like already five, including Lexus. And I was like... Yeah, Dude, I'll post a video of mine. It's so embarrassing. Oh. I'm gonna be dancing to who done it. You already know how YouTube trying to be copywriting everybody. They try to copyright this song with Who Done It from Disney. So just enjoy me dancing without no sound. Uh. Who done it? Done it? Done? Who done it? Done it? Uh huh. <laughs> I would get so mad because she would always laugh at me and I was so serious. Like, I was trying to she win. She was like... <laughs> Bro, she was we like... did this video like 20 <laughs> times because she would be laughing at me. Dude. Speaking of outfits, um, one time when we were younger... We weren't even that young. I think I was like 10. Yeah, I was like, like 12. <laughs> <laughs> I was 12. <laughs> she was like, 
one time when um we were when we were like <laughs> ten and twelve. Yeah. Um, my mom. And it was like with Vicky and Rachel too. So our our mall would do this thing where they have like runways. Yeah. In the middle of the mall. And like you, you can be in it, you know, just to get a chance to be like a little model, and you can like get modeling agencies and stuff. But um, I remember when we went to go get outfits, my mom was like, "Let's go to um, Chester's place, everybody." And yeah, like, we got we got like full on outfits, like full boots. outfits, boots and all. And my mom and was then, like, my mom was like, after we're gonna take it back. <laughs> yeah, she was like, keep the tags on. We're just gonna hide. <laughs> we ended up keeping them, but yeah. So like there was this little like ghetto runway at our mall or whatever it was like a big deal they had like a bunch of there was like actually kind of a lot of people that went or whatever they still do it yeah and all we <laughs> all we did was basically just go walk on it down it yeah it was like walk down we were just like <laughs> and then we're like and then we'll be like yes and then literally and then like after they were doing like private like meetings with all the parents saying if like their daughter made it or whatever like if they, they were, were like calling if they were model material <laughs> and then they literally i feel like they literally called everybody back and said they were model material like <laughs> you're in congratulations they thought they were fooling people basically and then my and then we ended up getting in it mom was all excited and then she saw the prize she was like you're <laughs> um, not doing it <laughs> like, she's like it's too expensive <laughs> she's like, so I remember we were on the radio or whatever's and I remember on that thing like you know they do like little commercials or whatever so they were talking about like Disney Channel meeting or whatever and if you like got in you had the chance to like be in a Disney Channel car like show or whatever and you know I wanted to be on Shake It Up so like I was <laughs> you like, know, like so like you know mom, we really thought we were some dancers we gotta do this homie <laughs> like before I found YouTube I was a dancer and an actress <laughs> so I, he I heard it or whatever and like I told my mom but like I didn't think she was actually gonna do it because she like didn't like I didn't do it huh no we remember. both did it really yeah I remember and I remember you got to be with like a girl and I was with the guy okay so it was like this little crest commercial like we were basically we had like little lines or whatever that we had to practice like everybody had it so everybody oh had God, to like I practice these that. lines and they were online and me and Alexis would practice them like every day like we'd be like it would be like crest for kids and it would be something like that so we had like a script or whatever and then on the day that we had to like perform or perform on the day we had to audition or whatever yeah yeah so there were like three different lines and we all went in different lines or whatever and the two girls that we were like friends with for like a really long time they lived in our neighborhood they went to it too and um they're really good singers. Okay, anyways. Yeah, they can sing, bro. Yeah, like, they were a heck of more talented as They me. were so talented at, like, everything. Yeah, they were really good. Like, we were, like, bootleg version of them. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, we used to not be able to go to their house because we would argue so much. Yeah, no, we wouldn't be able to go to anyone's house. Like, <laughs> even our Aunt Kayla. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to go to my grandma's or, like, go in the same car. Like, they would only make one of us go. <laughs> okay, but anyways. So there were like three different lines and Alexis got to be with, there was like two girls and one guy and Alexis got to be with the girl and I got to be with the guy and I was so pressed. I was like, now I'm going to do bad. Like, I'm not going to be an actress now. Like, why would you do this to me? But we ended up doing it and I was like, press for kids. Like, I didn't have no emotion. I remember this so vividly. I remember I'd practice it like, press for kids. <laughs> and then when I auditioned, I was like, press for kids. Press for kids. I would be like so monotone. But anyways, so yeah, like I feel like I did so bad. And I remember Alexi and Alyssa like told us that they got a call back or whatever. Like they like got a call back. Like they yeah, were, they got a call back. Basically. Yeah, like we they, didn't know. <laughs> like we didn't get a call back. No, at we're so not talented. Like we're <laughs> okay. So how we're talking about we used to have roommates in our house. My mom had this one roommate and she had a kid, and he was like really really bad. No, it wasn't just like a roommate. Roommate. <laughs> roommate. <laughs> No, like, we had a bunch of different people. We had, we had like, a my, bunch of roommates. Yeah, we had, like, my mom's friend. It was in the same house, too, because we had, like, four room, no, like, three rooms to rent out. Yeah. So we had my mom's mom, and then we had my mom's brother, and then we had my mom's friend. My mom's mom's brother's wife, Aunt Tanya. Oh, yeah. But it was all different It was, like, types. ex-wife. It was, like, ex- yeah, different types. And, like, two but mom's this, friends. But then Victor's we, friend. Oh, yeah. We had, fun. Then we had so many roommates. But the only roommate I didn't know was that redhead girl. Like, we didn't really ever yeah, talk when she was there. Yeah, we never But then my mom had another friend. I didn't really know her either, but, like, once she was there, like, I started getting to know her. But, um... You talk a lot. <clears throat> and you love it. So. Like, we kind of knew her, and she had a son, and he was, like, the same age as me, I think. Yeah. And I remember he... He was pretty fun. Oh, my he God. Had, he was fun with us, but he was Bro, really disrespectful he to look, his mom. He had a crush on me. You had a crush on him. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't <laughs> Okay, so one time, we're just going to call him Lightbulb. So one time, Lightbulb, we're in Lightbulb's mom's room. And he was bad. Like, 
<laughs> okay, so one time, he like literally, I don't know where he got a lighter from, but he like lit a toilet paper or something on fire, and he got scared, and he was like, and threw it on his mom's bed. It was like, he literally threw it on my bed, and I was like. No, it wasn't your bed, it oh, was no, his mom's bed. It was bed. his mom's bed, and I like put it out so fast. We used to have like, um, water parks in the backyard with him. It was kind of fun. Was he was really fun. Do you remember any experiences at Sandrini? Uh, Alright guys, so um, before we went to Sandrini, this little, I love Sandrini, it was a little ghetto school, but it was, all the kids were there were so fun, yeah. Yeah, there were some real, real ones. Before that, we went to this little white kid school at Old River, and it was by my mom's, well not a white kid school, but it was like, um, better, like, um, environment. School more money, you feel me, you know what I'm trying to yeah. say? But, um, we went to school over there, my mom would drive us like 30 minutes over there like every day, um, cause it was a nice, it was a good school. And it was by her friend's house. So and we, that was when her friend like watched us, but then her friend ended up moving to Nebraska. Okay, so um, my mom ended up taking us out of that school because she was tired of taking us in the morning. But we would wake up at, like 5 a.m. or like 4 a.m., go to her house, sleep in until like 6 or 7, get, and and she, would get she, would, she would get us ready. And um, I remember one time I was at that school and we were only there for, I was there first and third grade. I mean, kindergarten through third grade, half a third grade. I was there only until first grade. Yeah, and um, I remember one time there was this boy, and I had a crush on him, right? And I was like, yeah. I don't know why I was mean to people I had a crush on. And I literally pushed him off. So the boy I had a crush on, right? I pushed him down the the um, monkey bars thing, and mm -hmm. I was going to get in trouble because I think he broke his arm. I oh. think he broke his arm. He broke something, or he, like, he broke it. <laughs> like, I put, and he fell literally, like. And uh, I went to the bathroom, right? And I stayed there for a cool minute and I like changed my hair. If I had it down and I put it up, I like changed my whole outfit and I would just walk around the school, like the rest of it. Cause I was so scared they're gonna come in there cause they see me walk in the bathroom. And I never got in trouble for that. Ah. Wait, I'm trying to, I remember like, I had a crush on this little guy in kindergarten. And I remember he would be on his seat and I would be like, <laughs> he would be like, no, would be like, <laughs> weird. like literally in the front. And I, and I remember, um, remember that time you farted? And you blamed it on another kid when you guys were reading on the mat, on the uh, carpet? <laughs> no. Remember you told me? I don't remember that. <laughs> <laughs> remember when... You fight and blame down the guy next to you in third grade. <laughs> oh, we gotta go. We gotta end this. My mom's getting mad at us. So. Yeah, bye, guys. See y'all tomorrow.